Hello brother, welcome back to EO4, Paradox Gamer playing One Faith as Catholic Ottomans. And we attacked Ming last time, it's about time. We are advancing heavily in the north and fighting a defensive battle in the south. Ming occupied Dakar and they'll go back to Chittagong. They still need to take out this fort to be able to advance. We could move in and take them out one by one. But this guy is still a bit far away. So I don't know if he will actually make it there in time. Also gotta be aware of... Yeah, they have this one army in the north. is Which is now a 55 stack. See, now they are making a lot of armies. That's because they have a lot of manpower. As we can see here, this... But they're already down to 66. They had more than 100,000 to start with. And it's already down to 66. So we're gonna yap away at their manpower. Let's see what this is. Exploration. No, I'm gonna stick with my attack. Uh, but we gotta be aware of this stack. Here it comes. It's going to go me. Arriving on the 12th, come down here. So they got this guy moving in. Put out on the 6th. All right, let's move them all to Dakar. Conversion done. Let's go up and see where his army is heading. It's the station. No, it's going to a gin down here. Probably want to attack Hammy. He will be there on the 29th. These guys will arrive on the 4th of January, in which time I will attack him again. Maybe attack the Chittagong, which will make him give up the siege. That's a good idea. Can this one hold on? It's 35 now. Yeah, it can hold on. Let's see up here. These guys are now heading to heading to Sang Yi, which is further south. These guys are moving south. That's a bit weird. I could move these guys around. No, we cannot. Okay. So, 4th of January. We will assault full scale down here. Arriving on... Hang on. On the 13th. Gain 10 prestige or base tax? Well, prestige is pretty good. But I want that extra turn prestige now, or the 94. Let's see if that prompts this siege to be uh, undone. There's no sign of his army over here. We're waiting for these two sieges at 0 and 35 respectively to finish up. And this battle has just started. He's losing morale fast. Alright, that was a heavy loss for the Chinese. So what we'll do now is we'll go straight up here through Dakar. And we'll get some morale in a few days. Let me just check if the Chinese army is back up here. No, it's not. And if we can get to seal it before it falls that would be preferable Hami has fallen so that opens up down here he still got that army moving around so until I know its whereabouts I'm just gonna move over there and over there back to here we'll be in Dakar on the 6th 
February. I will be in Silet on the 12th. Come back up here, we can see the army now. It's heading for Hami. Which means we're gonna make a stand. And unfortunately these guys are gonna have to move around. Do we have enough troops? We got about 60, so we got the same amount. And the general is just about the same. So we should be okay, but let's send this guy down just for making sure. And when will that battle uh, commence? On the 20. So let's go down here for the 12th. We did get there before the siege fell. And another heavy loss for the Chinese It's going to be here. Let's go back up here. We have this battle going on. Looks like we're going to win that too. And just in case it's going to get close, we have reinforcements on the way already. Let's go back down here. And another big win. And a relief on the um, on the province. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to move back again. Because he can still assemble a pretty big army. Actually, it's not that big anymore. Alright, let's go on the offensive then. Um, Alright. Send this guy in there. Send this guy in there. And this guy will go... down here, just into the three border provinces. Back to this battle up here. It's a bit closer than I saw the last time I was up here. Let's see, these guys will arrive on the 14th and then it's still a way to go, so they won't be there in time. So these guys are gonna make it themselves. And of course, we get some heavy losses, but also the Chinese. And they're already down to Just 100,000 and their manpower is dwindling fast. I got twice the number of soldiers now. So these guys, they just stay there. And then these two. This one is pretty beat up, so he will stay. The other one will head to Sang Yi and that fort over there. Back south. We're now on the offensive. This is costing a lot of money because of... Uh, whoa, he's right there. Okay, this is level 2 fort. It's uh, farmlands. These guys are not moving. But while his morale is down, we should probably attack. And then send these guys over as well. These guys can move in instead. Let's see how that goes. I'll get that before he gets more morale. Start up this one. That looks like a win to me. Yep. And more losses to his heart tested units. Let's just stay in there or even go up here. Back in the north. This one is still 28. Alright, let's start up the last one. I don't think he is happy about this. Chinese truce expired with Sakalava and we occupied Sagat. Go in there and 
over there. So these guys, Salaba, they might uh, form a coalition, but I don't think they're strong enough. They will only form a coalition if they are strong enough. Stack wipe. I oh, really got to be careful and watch what's going on down here because he might just attack me with with heavy heavy forces local superiority so we gotta be aware of that he's making troops all over the place move in there let's see let's use the other one with uh, some decent artillery let's move these guys down I move these guys in with the artillery up here nothing to see oh we already have oh they're moving through okay so now I'm zooming out a little bit so I can get the overview occupied Kalik these guys are headed to Sindan so let's go to Yuman And we got 22, although the um, ticking war score is not ticking yet, because we did lose one battle. Also remember these troops that he has, they can also turn north. Okay, we got that fort. come down this way so the next fort is where fort level none there's one here nothing up here in the north it's back to 120,000 men and his manpower is still dwindling See, now it's coming up north, one of the stacks, it's going to hit the rear sand troops, and I'm not going to help them out. Alright, Malabar, they can handle themselves, I think we should probably put the other guys, uh, rear sand and Multan, they should just merge up with my guys. We can just tick this guy. We occupied Pagan. And these guys are going to Nagar. So let's come around and go into that one. Okay, let's go there first then. No sign of the main navy. I think they're chilling. Kokot Sokolo. Gain stability. Or prestige. Well, I have three stability and almost full prestige. But I'll grab the rest of the prestige. So we're back to 100. And we occupy a Jin. So the Chinese are stationary in Ribong. These guys are coming down to Gobi. I could go into uh, Al-Aqsa. I need to go around for that. Alright, let's we'll just move these guys forward then. And these guys can head to Gobi, I guess. War score is only 20, and that's because they uh, won that battle. Hmm. Not sure if that counted. Alright, coming in behind me. 
moving to Kalik, which is desert. Let's force a fight over here then. 40 against 40, that should be okay. Whoops. Monthly tick. Oh, they're headed back. Now they're going to sinning. So let's just um, come back down this way then. Alright. Conversion done. We got nothing else to start up. Seat of Sang Yi is over. Was that the fort? Yes, it was. The forts are starting to come quickly now. Um, let's just see where this guy is going. He will arrive in two days. Or oh, was that October? Well, that's a month from now. Uh, let's wait anyway. Down here, nothing. So we got a couple of forts being worked on. 35 and negative 21 respectively. This one will fall. We got Gobi occupied and here they come. 60 stack. Luckily we got troops right next to them. They will arrive on the 20. We'll be there on the 4th and on the 29th. These guys need to be quick about it. 26 and 29, that's fine. And then these guys are coming in from the other side. I think they're gonna pass human. And just go through that way. Just in case we need them. Oh! They got stopped by some rebels. We got Alksa and Manipur. Okay, now we're starting to see rebels all over Ming. That's what we want. That's what we want to see. Uh, this guy is probably actually stuck, so when he's done with the rebels, he will be back on the path towards Alaxa. And these guys can just simply move in. I think I'll take these guys up here instead, just because I don't want these guys in the back. Okay, so yeah, he does continue, and he, but he's not locked in yet. Let's see if he unlocks. No, nope, he's now locked in, arriving under 30. So both of these guys will be there when he arrives. That's 53, and then another 27 on top of that. That's 90. No, I can't count. That's 80 against his 60,000. On the 30, there we go. And another win. Is that enough to get the ticking war score going? Let's see about the losses are pretty heavy though. Still not enough for the ticking. Why haven't we won 80 battles? 80%. Hmm. Okay. Alright, let's split these guys up. Uh, this one is moving towards me. Lang Zhao is dry lands. So why don't we uh, use the momentum and move in here. Oh, they got got to go around. Most of them has to go around. Because that's the way they came in. Alright, just stay here and see what he will do on the 24th. He will. He will stay there. And this is Drylands. 
I still can't go there. Alright, we can send one guy around then. Let's see. Uh, one of those two. This one, go there. The other one, stay. And this one, stay too. In the south, we're okay. The no more Ming armies moving around. How much do we see? We see approximately 88,000 Ming troops. And he's got 123. So there's still a big stack somewhere. He's out of manpower now, so am I. But I got mostly mercenaries, so that's fine. Let's check the rebels. Garjati in five years and Oat in ten years. So I think we're okay on that. <clears throat> we're gonna beat up the rebels up here. Let me just finish that battle. Okay. Oh, they're also up here. So we got all the main troops up in the north now. That's interesting. So these guys... We can come down this way. Now we got the Multan army on the, uh, on the toe. Because otherwise they're just gonna get themselves killed. Down here we got main particularists. Total war score is only 26, so we gotta fight a little bit more. And that's gonna be in the next episode. So thank you for watching. I will uh, see you in the next one. Take care, guys. Bye-bye.